it's Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom and I'm here today for an unboxing of my Simply Gilded Sunbox. So this is um, April. This is the April box. The theme was first class. I uh, did get into it because I just wanted to see it because I was looking forward to it. Um, but it is very, very overstuffed. So um, it's got neutral colors and rose gold foiling and then the back is a nice chocolate brown which is why I was so looking forward to this. Um, and then there's like little passport stamps for different countries on here and bow, airplane, globe, just really pretty. And then the sides of the sub boxes always say the name and the volume. So this is the 30th one. Um, what I'm actually going to do now is I'm going to put that there. I'm going to take everything out off camera because she does include mystery items in the sub boxes now. And I don't like to show those on camera just in case you haven't gotten yours yet and you want to be surprised. So I'm going to empty this out and then we will go through it. All right, so we're actually going to go mostly in the order of the inventory card. I don't know what. To actually call this. I just call it an inventory card. Um, I say mostly because I do like to save the washi for last. So the first thing on the card is actually the journaling card. So it's that same pattern that was on the cover, like the box, but the box it was going this way and the plane was going like straight with the lines. This way the it's just oriented a little bit differently, but it's still that beautiful rose gold foil. The next two things on the list after the washi tape is actually the stickers. So you get a kit and then you get some extras. So the extra stickers this month, we have the seals, which there's always some sort of seal that is included. Her sticker paper is like kind of like a vinyl-y material. So yeah, it's really, really smooth, but it is kind of hard to write on. But for the, you get these hearts, you have empty hearts, and then you have different sayings. So bon voyage, hola, bonjour, ciao. Um, and I'm sure that's also some form of hello. Um, I, I don't know. I didn't watch the, unfortunately, I didn't watch any of the lives where she was going through this. Um, she is really detailed and thorough when she explains everything in the boxes. I just missed that one. So these are the seals. Um, I'm actually really excited about this sheet. I use some of these in, like from like the ones that we've already gotten in my spread this past week. And I really liked them. They are very pretty. They are foiled icons. So you have just two different rows and then it just repeats. So you have bow, let me bring it up so you guys can see. So, and starting with that top left, there's a bow, credit card, envelope, camera, car, and a TV. And then jumps down to the line below it, trash can, spray bottle, washing machine, fork and spoon, dumbbell, and a book. So she's been including these in all of the kits. So I now have plain gold, plain silver. This is the rose gold. And then I have two or three different colors of these. And then we actually also have date dots. So you have one month worth of dots. And then we have some other icons. So heart, dollar sign, a nurse's symbol, bow, travel, plain. Um, and then these are the same as over here. And then this is the actual sticker kit. So it's two full pages and a mini sheet. So you have, oh, it actually has the, oh, thank you so much. So it actually has the names of the cities over in the top left corner. So you actually have three full boxes over here. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. So this is actually just one full box. I thought maybe it was like, cut out as headers. Okay, so you have three over here, five on this page, and then another over here. So you have nine total full boxes. So you have 
um, Agra, Paris, London. This is just a map. New York, Kyoto, um, an airplane, and then another map. And then all of the, uh, just a list of different cities. Um, you get two sets of date covers. So Monday through Sunday, the dark brown says, <laughs> hi Pepper, good girl. The dark brown says vacation, the pink says me time. You have some headers over here, so you have two meetings, two appointments. Oh, there's actually a washi Wednesday. Oh, I'm excited, she changed it up. Um, groceries, meal plan, cleaning day, laundry day, planning time and celebrate. So you have circle icons and flag icons. You have four, four heart checklists over here. You actually have some headers over here in alternating colors. So you have like a pattern of like the um, maps and then just a solid brown. Um, we have some deco and then we have some more headers. So these are the same thickness as the date covers. So you have today, two remembers, two importance, to do, to buy, to pay. I think that covers all of the stickers that were on this, sh those two sheets. And then on the mini sheet, you have some more deco. You have one large seven heart checklist and two four heart checklists in just solid rose gold. And then you have four half boxes. Now, like I said, this is like a mat or like a vinyl material. So it is very difficult to write on these, but you can use a permanent pen. Um, she had included one in a previous sub box that I've used on these and it just doesn't come out as like vibrant as using regular pen on regular paper. So I'm not sure. I probably would end up just layering stickers over top of these instead of writing on them. I'm not, I'm going to, I was struggling to get this opened. It is um, the B6 notebook. So since I'm having trouble, I'm just not going to fight with it right now. Um, but this is a B6 size traveler's notebook insert. Um, typically they are either completely blank or she uses a five millimeter dot grid on the inside. Um, pages are just plain white, but I love that it is brown and it has that airplane pattern on it. I really love the stripe. The stripe is what's getting me, but the airplane being that gold foil, or rose gold foil is just beautiful. Then we have the thing that I look forward to probably the most. Um, I love the washi tape, but man, I love the engraved gel pens that she includes in all of these sub boxes. So this has the airplane and then it is leaving a dust of stars and hearts in the trail behind it. Rose gold hardware. And it is a white barrel, but it seems like there are like micro glitters in, in it as well. So this is a 0.5 tip black ink gel pen. And I will be swatching out the washi tape on this paper. So what I always like to do is write the name of the sub box on here and then swatch it out below. So we have Painted Garden was on the other side. And then this is going to be first class. So I'll be getting that swatched out there. And then, oh, I had to make it a little bit like wider just because this was a little bit large. This is a vegan pearl sticker pouch. So I love that she is doing things that are like other than the regular pouches that she had been doing. I have so many of them and they're so pretty, but I, don't really have a use for them, I'm finding. I don't know what to do with them all. So they're all just kind of sitting in a cupboard. Um, but this I'm really excited about. I love how soft it is. So you do still have a pouch to it. Um, so all of the washi tape and some extras came in here in the pouch. And then in the back, there is a pocket and the stickers and the, like, the cards and the notebook came in here. So it was just kind of like nice and neat in there. Um, I think it's really pretty. Like I said, it is very soft and like floppy, but I feel like once you put your stickers in here, it'll have a little more structure to it. So I'm just really excited and I kind of forgot about this. I got this in at the beginning of, of the week. So like what was that? The 4th? Yeah, May 4th, I think, is when I got it in. I don't know, I might have gotten it in on May 2nd. I got it in really quick, so it was slightly delayed just because an item in the 
like one of the items that was in here got in late to her warehouse so then these came out late normally they ship the last week of april so it shipped like just a couple of days late late um but I still got it like really, really quick. Like it's supposed to ship the end of April. So I kind of expect that I'll have it the very beginning of the following month. So it wasn't late in my eyes. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. What else was I trying to say? I was trying to explain something. I don't know. Oh, yeah. So I had gotten this in and I had forgotten about it. And she did a release with more sticker books and I was this close to getting one of those sticker books and then I changed my mind at the last minute because I'm trying not to buy more stuff because like I'm starting to feel overwhelmed with the stuff that I have. So I didn't buy it and I'm happy because I had a sticker book. So yeah, there's a lot of pages and the thing that I didn't realize about this is that you can actually load it on each side. So you can load it from the back so that this side is facing forward and then you can also load it from the front. So this is facing forward and it's just very nifty. It is a really pretty color, but of course I'm probably more excited about the fact that it is rose gold hardware. And then we also have a Sakura Micro Perm Pen in 05. So this is an ultra fine pen. Um, this is similar to the one that she had included in a sub box previously it's just a different thickness so this will write on her stickers but like I said it just doesn't come up as like a bright black like it's not very vibrant it's yeah I don't really know how to explain it I this I actually did not take it out brought you in closer um this was the item that um that was delayed. So these are travel scissors. So depending on which, like everybody got a different color. It was either white or black. So you couldn't say which one you wanted. So I didn't take it out. That that's actually kind of cool. I will probably end up using these because like I'm I'm not traveling right now. No one's traveling right now. Um, but I will probably use these for my planner because the scissors that I have been using, which I don't even know where they are now because they're not where they're supposed to be, but they've been getting very gummed up and I've needed to replace them for a really long time and I'm just terrible at that. So now I have scissors. And then the only other thing on the card is the mystery item and the washi tape. So this is all the washi tape that comes with the box itself and everything else that you have seen comes with a subscription. This washi is an add-on. It is five millimeters and I, I love the five millimeter add-ons. So, yep, I've got it. Um, we have, we actually have a lot. So we have two 15 millimeter rolls, two 10 millimeter rolls, two like six or six and a half millimeter perforated headers. And then we have four rolls of five millimeter. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get these opened up and swatched out and really show you guys without a glare from the plastic. All right, so I've got the wrappers off of all of these rolls and I'm so excited. I love how neutral the majority of them are. Um, very simple, just very pretty. Um, I'm obsessed with rose gold. Like that is my favorite color, like my favorite foil color. So I love that you have like the very thin, very fine lines, like the horizontal lines, and then you have the bow. So these are 15 millimeter rolls. So these two, these are the 10 millimeters. I think I already explained that. So depending on the size roll, the bow is going to be a different shape. So you'll only see these, these bows on the 15 millimeter. You'll only see these bowls on a 10 millimeter. And then you'll only see these bows on five millimeters. So, um, yeah, it's a nice, soft, like a, a toppy cream. It's with like a hint of a pink undertone. Really beautiful. And I'll show you up close also on the paper. Um, then we have the maps of the world and each iteration of the, of the map, of the global map has little hearts on different, different locations. So like, each so this one is going to be different than the hearts over here um and then the next one is going to be different as well you have the airplane with the 
like the dust behind it with the hearts and the stars. And then you've got two inverted foils. So you have a perforated inverted foil and then a vertical bow inverted foil. Um, you've got, this one's also the perforated, I couldn't speak. Uh, but I love that you have those two colors because they end up matching these. So just perfectly matched. This chocolate, I feel like I already have a skinny chocolate, but I don't know, it might not be rose gold bows. But now I'm just like, I don't know how much five millimeter chocolate bows I need. So here's the thing. I wanted to be able to show you guys how easy the perforated washi is. So what you do, it's so easy. It's perforated out so that each section is an inch and a half. So you will just pull super easy and you're able to put it down, use them as headers. Um, most vertical style planners, that's like the standard column width is an inch and a half. So these are perfectly sized for you to use within those columns. And it's really easy to just tear them. So look at that foil. It's so pretty. And when I say inverted foil, what that means is that the pattern that's on it is not foiled and the background of the tape is foiled. So like the stars are just white and everything else is foiled. The hearts are white and everything else is foiled. Whereas over here, the stars are foiled and then the background is that creamish, like dusty pink color. So hopefully that that makes sense. Um, the only thing that disappoints me about the washi tape is over here. There we go. You can see it. You can see a line on the pattern. So that's the only thing that's a little bit of a letdown. But other than that, I think it's absolutely stunning. And that's going to do it for this unboxing. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos. If you press the bell icon, it'll actually give you pop-up notifications so that you'll know as soon as my videos go live. And be sure to be following me over on Instagram. Over there, I'm at Coffee Planner Mom, and I will see you guys later.